The highly speculated merger between Churchill Capital SPAC, CCIV, and the new electric vehicle company, Lucid Motors, has captivated the attention of Wall Street investors for weeks. However, we believe we have reason to say that the merger may be announced very soon. In today's video, we will be telling you exactly what date we think the Lucid CCIV merger may be announced and why this guess is very probable. So let's jump right into it. Hello everyone, this is Mark with MC Stocks. Remember to subscribe and hit the like button for more videos like this one. And as always, remember to do your own due diligence when investing and seek a financial advisor for professional advice. So Lucid Motors, a new American electric vehicle maker, also dubbed the Tesla killer, may be entering the public stock market through a SPAC merger. We have speculated why this merger is highly probable with a good variety of strongly supporting evidence and statistics. Let's briefly recap why Lucid Motors may want to choose to merge with Churchill Capital's CCIV SPAC instead of another SPAC or just IPOing on their own, or if they will be going public at all. Well, we can point to Lucid Motors' recent job postings as a very strong indicator that the company has clear plans to go public. With the positions of Director of Investor Relations, Investor Relations Analyst, and SEC Reporting Manager, it seems pretty obvious that they plan to get listed as a publicly traded company in the New York Stock Exchange. Next, let's look at Andrew Leverus. Andrew plays a very key role to this merger theory. He's not only the chairman of the Lucid Board of Directors, but is also an operating partner at Churchill Capital's CCIV. We can even see that he is listed as one of the operating partners right on CCIV's website. But that's not all. The CEO of Churchill Capital has worked closely with Andrew Leverus on previous merger deals. With a comfortable relationship between the two, a merger between their two companies seems that much more likely. But the next reason why a merger between CCIV and Lucid Motors is likely may be the most telling. Saudi Arabia's public investment fund has invested over $1 billion into Lucid Motors. And guess what players are directly connected with Saudi Arabia's public investment fund? Andrew Liveris was appointed as a special advisor to the public investment fund and to the crown prince of Saudi Arabia. Furthermore, Michael Klein has also advised the Saudi Arabian public investment fund even getting them to invest in his SPAC, Churchill Capital 3. For Lucid and CCIV to merge, with Saudi Arabia's public investment fund being a common denominator, drastically raises the odds of a deal following suit. So, now that we understand the evidence pointing towards a very probable Lucid CCIV merger, let's discuss when exactly this merger seems most probable to occur. First, recall how big of a role Saudi Arabia's public investment fund is playing. With an investment of $1 billion, they own more than half of Lucid Motors. Clearly, with this large of a stake in the company, and with the relatively recent reveal of the Lucid Air EV, Saudi Arabia's public investment fund would surely like to boast the products of their investments. So what venue better to do that in other than their future investment initiative conference? This conference is Saudi Arabia's annual tech and innovation conference where major projects and investment announcements are presented. This year, the conference will be held on January 27th and 28th. You may wonder, what would they want to announce at the conference regarding Lucid Motors? Well, they could easily highlight the new car and all of its great features, with a sleek design, fantastic 500-mile battery range, and fast charging capability, it would be a challenge to not like the car. They could also highlight the impressive feat of how they were able to quickly build a factory in Arizona in under a year. Or better yet, they could make the announcement that every investor is dying to hear, that Lucid Motors is going public through a merger with CCIV. This announcement alone may steal the show, given the immense hype around the potential merger. Plus, the announcement makes the most sense for the public investment fund to do during the future investment initiative conference. Just the name of the conference in itself is a big clue. Since the public investment fund is directly invested into Lucid Motors, and with the fairly clear goals from Lucid on their plans to go public, announcing the SPAC merger during the conference makes the most sense. According to this tweet from Alex Cutler that we discussed in one of our previous videos, it is also speculated that Lucid may have the intention to go public as soon as April this year, and to start their car deliveries by the summer. With SPAC mergers being one of the quickest ways to get into the public market, the announcement of a merger should occur soon to do so. This means that in just a few days, 
if there truly are talks between CCIV and Lucid Motors, the most optimal time to announce a merger is within just a few days. And the Saudi Arabian Public Investment Fund is holding their annual Future Investment Initiative Conference at just the right time on January 27th and 28th. Still not convinced? Check out this clip where we literally see the CEO of Churchill Capital, Michael Klein, being interviewed at the conference event a few years ago. With this video evidence, we don't think it will be too surprising to see him again this year, possibly ready to deliver some major announcement about the highly anticipated merger. Now we do have to disclose that this is purely speculation as there is no official confirmation made claiming that such an announcement will be made at the event or that there even will be a merger between CCIV and Lucid Motors. However, with all the evidence, connections, and leaks falling very well into place, we are just presenting the highly probabilistic case that if there were to be a merger, it will most likely be presented at this conference. Given that it is a two-day event, we may be able to speculate further on which particular day they may choose to disclose Lucid going public. There are a few things to consider. First, Saudi Arabia is in a completely different time zone than the US. So nighttime in the US is the following morning in Saudi Arabia. This means that the majority of the conference will be held during the after hours or pre-market times. Depending on how they choose to schedule their conference, in the event that they do decide to announce a merger, they may choose to announce it Steve Jobs style, near the end with a one more thing announcement. But there is one more thing. If they do go this route, we can expect the announcement made after hours on the 27th or pre-market on the 28th. But if you do anticipate this merger, it would be safest to buy the stock prior to the event entirely and enjoy the skyrocket up after they make the announcement. All the evidence we have discussed makes the probability of a lucid CCIV merger more and more likely. The timing of Saudi Arabia's Future Investment Initiative Conference perfectly lines up with our theories and paints the perfect picture for what may soon come. If you have not yet bought shares of CCIV and are looking for a brokerage, be sure to use our referral links in the description below. M1 Finance is doing a great offer currently where you could get a free $30 using our referral link. So use the link below, earn an easy $30 and don't miss out. Good luck everyone with your holdings and stay tuned on our channel for any news regarding this Lucid CCIV merger. Thank you for watching today's video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to get notified when we release our next video. Please like and share for more videos similar to this one and comment below with any questions that you may have so that we can address them in future videos. Thanks.